everybody. It's Annette from The Art of Intuition. And today we're gonna lighten it up and talk about a question I get asked a lot. Why do we dream about sex? Now, this is a question, it's funny, because anyone who wants to talk about dreams always brings up this subject. Why do we dream about sex? So let's take a minute to talk about sex in general, as far as how it relates to consciousness and raising our vibration and increasing our um, ability to see more. Drugs, alcohol, sex, they all have one thing in common. They all clear distortions. So sex clears distortions. It brings up all of our stuff like nothing else does. It activates our root chakra and it brings up all those root chakra energies. So even though you get to a certain level and all the chakras, I had to use levels, but you get to a certain space and all the chakras kind of combine anyway. But there is a part of the process where you're either having a lot of sex because you're, you're clearing a lot of distortions, you're not having any sex because your body is trying to purify and sex in general is not a process that purifies. I mean, in a sense it does because it helps you clear distortion, but there's a time when you don't want to have it because you're in a separate part of the process where you're just clearing you're trying to raise your vibration and repair DNA and you don't want to taint DNA with another person and sex will commingle DNA. So that's one reason why sometimes you have it, sometimes you want to, sometimes you don't want to. And I always tell people to respect where you are with that because it's not a personal thing with a partner. If you have a partner that if you do, or if you don't, you know, it's just kind of where you're setting in those moments, but it's not a, it's not a personal thing. So not to take it personal. So you clear, so sex clears distortions. So I've talked a lot about the dream world. The dream world is no different than this world. It's a different reality. This is a physical reality we're in here. So it feels more real to you because you're kind of anchored in here, but it's no different than what you see in the dream world. So when you dream about sex, you're clearing distortions in those realities through sex. It's sort of the same thing. Now, I never rule out any precognitive dreams because we always dream the future. We don't dream anything in the past in a sense and everything bleeds over. There are no closed systems. So a lot of the stuff we dream, the energies will bleed over even if the physical reality specifically does not bleed over. The energy will bleed over in the reality. So if you're clearing a lot of distortions in a separate reality that you're seeing when you're asleep and the higher your vibration goes, and the more you open up to the dream world, the more you'll see of these other realities. Because a lot of times we see things in the other in the dream world first before we see them here. A lot of times I'll see stuff in the dream world a couple years before they happen here. And some stuff is clearing distortion, some stuff actually happens. It just kind of depends. So don't get too bogged down in any of the stuff you see. And sometimes you don't see anything for a long time because it's so distorted and we're clearing so much when we sleep that we would get our humor would get so wrapped around it that it it would just get all caught up in something it doesn't need to get caught up about because we're just really clearing the energies. So you might find you're dreaming more about sex when you're not actually having it in this physical realm here. In this space here, you're not having it. For whatever reason, you're not having it. And sometimes people will say, well, I'm not having it by choice. It's not my choice. I'm like, but in a way it is. The universe is not bringing it around because it doesn't want you to do it right now. <laughs> so you can try to fight against that, but normally it won't, it won't work. Where other times you'll find that those doors are open a lot more because you're in a space where you need that to clear certain things you're trying to clear out of, the, out of, your, out of your energy field. So don't be surprised if you find you dream more about sex when you define you're not having it here. And sometimes you will not dream about it when you're having it here, or you'll be having it here and dreaming about it too. But just look at it as it's just a clearing, just like it is anywhere else. There's nothing wrong with you. It doesn't mean you're weird. <laughs> it could be precognitive if it's someone you, you really like and you're kind of open for it. Um, you never know, you never know. So don't rule that out either. You know, you never know when a lot of the stuff you see will eventually bleed over here, whether it might be um, you're gonna just clear in those realities and not here through um, sexual relations, or you're gonna clear here too later on. 
or you might be in a phase where you don't want to at all, don't judge that either. A lot of people get really wrapped. It's a really hot topic, especially when I, if I work with couples, it'll come up quite a bit. It comes up a lot in personal sessions too, where people really get kind of bogged down on it. If they should be, if they shouldn't be, why do they dream about it? So don't be concerned about any of that stuff. Just look at where you are. And you can always ask the question if you're not sure, should I be or shouldn't I be? Usually your universe will kind of show you unless you get in circles where you find you're repeating kind of the same stuff with the same energy. And sometimes we have to break that pattern and say no more, depending on what kind of energy you're coming from. Because sex is a very human thing our human does. It's not a soul thing the human does. It was, that didn't make any sense. Hey, let me reword that. It's not, the soul does not require it. The human uses it to fill a need. It's clearing distortions. That's what it's utilized for. That's what it's for. So wherever you are with it, wherever you are in the dream world with it, realize it's just as real as here. You're going to clear one way or the other and keep practicing the art of intuition.